Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time, please subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way you can find out whenever I come out with a new video. Today, we're gonna to be doing a pizza oven hack. We're gonna find out a way to make amazing pizza in a regular old electronic or gas home style range like this. We're gonna be doing a couple little modifications with where the shelves are at. And then I'm gonna give you all a couple little tips that'll help you get the best pizza you can out of your oven. Let's get started. is we're going to need two of these pizza grill discs. One of them is going to be to bake our pizza on. The other one is going to be a support for some briquettes. If you guys have seen my other video where I modified my grill by taking off the original heat deflectors and replacing with ceramic briquettes, you know that I got a couple extra left over and I was just thinking of something to do with them. So here we go. The other thing you're going to need is just a pizza stone. Regular old pizza stone. This is actually more of a, a cube. This came out of a, another pizza grilling device that I had at one point that broke, but this plate somehow survived. So this is what I use for my pizza stone in the base of my home pizza oven hack. Now for our shelves, we're gonna wanna arrange the bottom one, the second one up from the bottom, and the top one is gonna be just one slot above that. The idea here is we're gonna sandwich that heat in this small slot so we can cook our pizza to NY perfection. All right, let's get this thing put together. Don't forget that bottom shelf is just the second one up. You're gonna slide on your stone. The next shelf above it is just the next slot up. Get our briquettes on our grill. That's a 20 inch grill. And you can see they got these little humps and kind of the theory is that the heat's gonna come from all different directions and then it's gonna be focused on the flat side of that. Now you wanna preheat your oven all the way up to the max, the hottest it gets. Once it reaches its preheat, you wanna let it sit for at least an hour and then verify with a temp gun that all the surfaces are close to what they should be. Then you're gonna get a pizza just like this. Crispy bottom, amazing texture. We achieved this results because the stone on the bottom is gonna to work to draw moisture away from the pizza. And the briquettes on the top are gonna to work to cook that cheese at the same rate as the bottom. If you need help getting your pizza game up, check out my brother channel, Rad Dad Cooks. We got a whole series on pizza tutorials, everything from sauce to cheese to dough. Come on by and check it out. Well, I hope this little quick hack is enough to get you all out of the pizza dumps and back into the game, whipping up some freaking badass pizza in your home oven. See y'all next time. Bye. Thank you for tuning in to another episode of JTV. Don't forget to like. Oh, man. <laughs>